G'day and welcome back to another gas walkthrough. Today we're looking at May 26th, 2025's 789 by Clover. Clover's one of our subs here at Gas HQ, so online. My name is Bill Murphy. G'day, how you doing? Apologies about the sound for today. I'm just trying to get a walkthrough up. Uh, I am currently in the process of uh, migrating to a new laptop. Uh, so apologies if I have to figure out what the sound sounds like for this laptop. Um, all right, so uh, we are gas, genuinely approachable Sudoku. We create, set, and solve genuinely approachable Sudoku for you, the person watching this. Uh, you will find the link to today's puzzle in the description down below. You will also find hat times. Two hats for a very fast time, one hat is for a pretty fast time, and everyone gets a dinosaur because we love you all equally. Uh, that being said, I'm going to jump into today's puzzle now. Let's get going. So, this is a diagonal sum to nine Sudoku. What does that mean? Well, normal Sudoku rules apply. So each box, each row, and each column must contain the digits one to nine once each. Uh, and along each gray line, every adjoining pair of digits must sum to nine. What does that mean? It means that if this is three and six, then this also must be three. Uh, we're going to use that knowledge quite a bit in a second. Uh, but that being said, that's all you need to know to solve today's puzzle. Uh, so we're going to get into it. Now, because we know that these digits have to repeat as they go, what we know is that a couple things. One, it's going to repeat bump, 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 all the way down. And then secondly, and also most importantly, uh, this cell and this cell have to be the same. What does that mean? Because everything has to sum to nine, it means that this can't be one or four and this can't be two or three. So because every adjoining digit has to sum to nine means that that has to be whatever the high digit is and cannot be the low digit. So this is four, 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 and this is five, Oi, oi, oi. five, five, and five. Same thing along this line. One, that cell and that cell have to be the same. So one and four, two and three, meaning that digit has to be high. So this digit has to be the low digit. And because it sees four, three, and two in that row, means that this has to be one all the way up and eight all the way down. What about, oh, all right, uh, this cell's the same. So, uh, because this, is that the same? Oh, have I backed myself into a corner here? Oh, hang on. That's okay. So, this is one and four and two and three. So, this digit has to be high. Yeah, sorry. That, I just... Oh, I've been a little bit out of it. All right, so this digit has to be the low digit. So it sees one and four, so it has to be either two or three. And if it were, ah, oh, but there's a three in that box. That's what I'm missing. So that's a two, seven, two, seven, two, and seven. Uh, is this digit the same? Well, I can't put a three there. Oh, but now if I look along here, that cell sees one, two, three, four. So this digit has to be the high digit along this line. Meaning this has to be the low digit. And because we see one, two, and four in a billion different ways, that's three. And all of these must be six. Uh, so that cell sees five and eight in the row. And I don't know whether that's five or eight yet. One and four to place in column five. Four here means that that's one, that's four. Uh, whew, uh, where does eight go in row eight? Must go there. This is a five, so that has to be seven and then five. Uh, whew, six, seven, and nine. Oh, that five unwinds this five and eight up here. That's wonderful. Uh, all right, can I do anything about this? Uh, this has to be either two, three, or five. So I'd be looking for four, six, or seven. 
No, wait, yes. Four, six, or seven. Cool. Okay, and in here, so this has to be two, three, or five. Can't be five, so it has to be either two or three, meaning I need six or seven up here. Seven here tells me that this is three and six. I'm just doing this so I don't have to keep track of the uh, Sudoku, uh, the uh, variant. Over here, one, five, six, and uh, one, four, five, six, seven in the row. Eight and nine in the column means that this has to be either two or three. Uh, and this needs to be either six or seven. Wow, I still don't actually know what that is. Cool. All right. Uh, five, eight, and nine to place across there. I've got, oh, five. Where does five go? Can't go in those cells because I've got a five here. So this is five, eight up here. Oh, no, this is a two or a nine, but the two here is going to do that for me. Okay. Wait, yay, yay. I am, uh, yeah. It's very weird how you get muscle memory when you jump onto a new computer. Uh, this is six and four, uh, two, three, and nine. Five and eight over here means that that's a six. Uh, five can't, can only go there because we have a five there, meaning this is eight. Uh, six, seven, and oh, 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 that's a four, that's a six, uh, seven, and two. Three nine there. Uh six seven nine. Six seven and nine. Nope. Uh one f uh that eight there is gonna do nine and eight for me there. Four here is gonna finish off box nine. Uh that nine is not quite gonna do a lot just yet, but that's okay. Uh six and one to finish row seven. Three, five, and two to finish box seven. Let's go up here. This is a four. Uh, oy, oy, oy. Three and nine. Three and nine. Uh, this puts a nine here. Seven. Six. Seven and six. And then the last two, four digits. Seven, two, one, and four. Wonderful. I don't think my time was nine minutes. No, it's not. It's six and a half cool uh thank you for watching uh this has been 789 by clover uh my name is still bill murphy uh wherever you are in the world i hope you have a fantastic rest of your day and i will catch you next time cheers